Yo, what is going on guys? Today I'm going to show you how you can get this really cool morph cut transition effect. Now this is a really cool effect and I most recently seen it in a lone wolf music video for a band called Triathlon. So I'll make sure to link that in the bio and you guys can check it out. Now this effect kind of reminds me of data moshing. It's probably not something you're going to use for all of your videos, but if you're making something that's really glitchy and sort of trippy, you'll be able to use this to add a little bit of extra sauce to your project. So without wasting too much time, you're going to want to have two clips in your timeline. I have my two clips right here. And then I'm going to go over to the effects rack and type in morph cut. And then if you hover over the effect in the middle of these two clips, you're going to see this analyzing in background. This is sort of similar to warp stabilize and some other effects in Premiere where you just have to give it a minute to process. All right, and you can already see that this is starting to get kind of trippy. Now, the only thing I don't like as I'm scrubbing through here is I'm seeing this sort of gray artifact blob at the bottom left. Now, this is one of those effects where you don't really have a ton of control. So a cool little workaround for this is if you just select both of these clips, right clicking them and then hit nest. I'm going to name this morph clip. Now, if you just select your new nested sequence and just scale in a bit, maybe play with the positioning a little bit. Now you'll see as you scrub through that you don't really have that great blob. So I'm just gonna render this really quick. Now, just like that, you have this really cool morph cut transition effect. I think that this is really cool and is a really good pairing with a music video that has data moshing in it or something that's just really trippy and kind of a little crazy. So uh, if you found this at all helpful, feel free to like and subscribe. I really appreciate it. I'm going to be dropping my first for sale digital product pretty soon here. So just stay tuned. All right. Take it easy, guys.